Gotcha. Okay, there's a place to hide. That's good. Several. There's one on each floor. Yep. Oh, that's a locker. Yeah. It, it will still work for easy, but yeah. I personally don't like them. It reminds me of Phasmo. Just hide in the locker. Just hide in the locker. Alrighty, it looks like we gotta hack it. Hacking noises. Remember when I said the pressure will be on? Hack the the pressure is on. The pressure pushing down on me, pushing down on you. You got it. It's satisfying as fuck though. Crouch. There you go. Yeah. I think the best strategy is just to Stay run really fast. Stay behind the box. Stay behind the box. <laughs> MC, I said the same thing. <gasps> oh my god. Yeah, aliens having a little fun with your former friends. It's okay. I would move now while he's distracted. I wouldn't. <laughs> what do you mean? He's 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 very busy with like five people that are shooting at him. Yeah, but if he finishes with them and then he spots them while he's hacking the elevator, he may not have enough time. Oh yeah, so let him. Be, yeah, so let him finish with the five people. So the only thing he can focus on is the one person that's left. Great idea. All Solid right. advice. I mean, okay, if you want to fall, if you want to do what Solar did, go ahead. Up to you, Golden. At least you saved, so you're good. Yeah. I'm just gonna follow your advice, Bliss. <laughs> it's up to you. <laughs> We have two very different survival strategies. Yeah. Stop. Stop. There is a box in front of you. There is. I'm worried if he comes upstairs, though, you're not going to have much of a place to hide except behind the crates. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Stay down in the crates! Okay. He went into the he, vents. He went into the vent. He's, he's in the vent. You're okay. You're okay. He's in the vents. <laughs> Are you good? Like I said, two very different survival strategies. Hey, 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 hey. Don't, don't despise strategy just yet. It might actually work. It worked for me. <laughs> I have a question about the aliens. Not yeah. now. Well, you... uh, <laughs> okay. Well, wait, wait, let her ask while you're paused, and you can catch your breath. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, it's, it's about like the aliens and their um behavior. I'm assuming they don't have any eyes, correct? Oh, they can like, see. Oh, are, do they have like you, poor vision? I assure you, they can see. They just can't see the way you think we th th it does. Well, that's what I'm asking. Does it have, like, actual eyeballs, or does it more have um, the sensors? Some fans believe they have an infrared ability. Some believe that they see through smell. Some believe it's echolocation. Um, but others, like me, do believe that they do have eyes. They're just behind the dome of their head, which is fairly transparent. Um, hmm. I believe they have some form of sight, but they also have an amazing sense of smell. So, and their hearing is oh, okay. absolutely phenomenal. Okay, I was just curious. I'm like, well, can it not see? Does it have poor, like, 2020 vision? Like, well, and thanks to Alien Prometheus, despite the fact that I have to accept that it's canon now. The alien is like a virus, a biological virus, and it's constantly adapting to its environment, so it's able to sense things a lot quicker than most beings. So. Oh, okay. Also, it is a way. parasite, yeah. so its attributes are dependent on its host. Yeah. Also, the aliens from Ooh. outer space. That too. Oh shit, I didn't know that! Fuck! <laughs> Dude, I thought they were from Dakota. The more you know. Detroit, actually. No. Now let's listen to some nice, soothing sounds of a spaceship. All right, go and go whoop that. Oh, yo, they took ass. my fucking space station. Can't have shit in Detroit. <sighs> All right. That's because Detroit became okay, human. Okay, he is in the vent. That does not mean you should run or make any noise. 
he could pop out at any time. And anywhere. And anywhere. So go slowly. Run. Don't tell him to run. He's gonna Come gobble back. that ass. Welcome back. Welcome back. Gobble, so gobble. So get to the elevator and go slowly. I believe okay. he's approaching behind you. It does sound like it, yeah. But I can't tell because he keeps moving his head back okay. and forth. <laughs> Where's the elevator? You downstairs. were looking at it. Downstairs. Also, just look above you, just just for me really quick. I'm curious. Okay, good. There's no camera right there. Okay, go forward. Oh, oh god. Turn around. Look, look where you're going. Look both ways before you cross the street. Oh, I mastered that. Okay, there's the stairs. He's been here for like 10 minutes. She I've been just gone back. for 10 minutes. Yeah, she just got back. Nice of you to know. Nice to meet you anyway. Okay, get to the elevator. Uh, hack it quickly. Hack the planet. Hack the planet. The pressure is on. No place where you can buy a cyber deck like that. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. Hit the switch on your right! You're good. He lives! He's good! He's Whoa. good! It's all thanks to me. Way to go, Way to go <laughs> Master like Code. Don't make me laugh when I fucking saw Mark Genis knows no bounds. Okay, there's people. Great. Ah. No, relax. Relax. You probably let's, did. Let's, <laughs> let's see first. Yeah, we need to find a saving point, and then I could just call it that. <laughs> uh. Resume. Crouch. Oh, I know where you are. It's not the people you think. That on your left, though, map. You missed it. On oh. your left. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. Okay. You're hey, good you for should now. go and check in at the desk. Yeah, you gotta check in and fill out the paperwork. Hey, hey, hey go back. Go back. Someone will be with you shortly. Hello. My name's Ripley. Amanda Ripley. I need your help. Please take a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. No wonder seats is losing the tech race. Uh, the healthcare system, am I right? <laughs> well, I mean, this is just... Everything in here is a corporate future dystopia. Oh, well, have fun. Because that was an early cyberpunk theme. Oh. The corporate Why is there eyes glowing? It's a robot. It's, it's an a robot. Oh, it's a working okay. Joe. It's a sex bot. But it's from a company that's like really far behind uh, Wayland, so uh, Wayland that's androids cool. look extremely human and can pass a Turing test. Uh, Seeks and obviously uh, can't. Comfort and reassurance, our working Joe synthetics are designed to be instantly recognizable. Surveys have shown that consumers are often uncomfortable dealing with advanced human real androids. Seeks and working Joes are unmistakable. So you always know exactly who you're dealing with. Be reassured. That's the seeks of promise. Your user comfort is our priority. Did you bring two forms of ID, including a social security card and your license? Shut up, Master Code. <laughs> <laughs> Is a box. On your right. Down on your right. Left. Now it's behind you. Oh. <laughs> Where? Alright. I think you could probably make more items. Okay. Um. Life moves fast, and it's easy to feel overwhelmed. Here in Seekson, we remember that the ultimate goal is clear communication. Yep, you can make in there a flare. Oh, wait. I don't think he can. No, he can't. Smoke bomb. Nope. Okay, I have a flashbang. Oh, never mind. You can. Jolly good. Nope, can't with the flashbang. All right. But how about... Uh... That kit? Yes. Yes. 
Good, good, good. How are you doing on health? Yeah, you could probably do with another, but eh, up to you. Yeah, lacking components for that, lacking yeah. components for that. Alright. Yeah, I don't <laughs> know about the flare. Yeah, put that away. Wait, what's Oh that? yes, you can also hide in there. In the cubby. In the cubby. Hey look, Bliss, they made it for you. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, we need a weapon. Where is that? Uh, my dude, there is no weapon to help you in this game. This isn't a game where you go shooty, shooty, gun, gun. You have to run and hide. You're a mouse in a cat's environment. You, oh, there there you, cat you have ma you have now gotten the grasp of it all. I, he he has... I'm sorry for the outburst. Uh. <laughs> also, he has a revolver. The ultimate so. game of hide and seek. I mean, not wrong. Or, like, capture the flag. You can trust our working Joes. Always there. Always helpful. Always working for so you. So, where do I go? Synthetics are made to be simple. No emotional simulations. No life real qualities. They just work for you. So you can get on with your life in perfect peace of mind. Working Joes. <laughs> brilliantly simple. And simply brilliant. Door access. That sounds pretty useful. That d oh, d you, you didn't do it. <laughs> you just turned off everything. <laughs> Door access. Now, now you turned it. Now you turned the same ones back on. <laughs> <laughs> turn the air. Yeah, turn that off. Yeah, nobody needs oxygen. That's a load of bullshit. Turn off the uh, camera feed too. Nobody needs to feed. see what's going on here. Now turn, turn on, on the door. door access. Yeah. There you go. We're good. Uh, sorry. I... No, no, you're fine. I hate the game mechanics in here a little bit too. They're kind of wonky. What the fuck? Everything's all turned off. O2. You what? turned off O2 purification. <laughs> It's okay. Go back. You're fine. Nobody needs O2. It's a bunch of liberal bullshit. Breathing is overrated. <laughs> oh shit. Who even fine. breathes? They're, They're fine. You For always now. know a working Joe. Yeah. Mm. You're fine uh, for now. I don't know any Joe. I like to slip into a persona like that whenever customers ask me weird questions. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Your registration is almost complete. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. I wouldn't advise it. Okay, well, fuck Not you too. Nuts. That's <laughs> terrifying. Yeah. As, as You're not should. supposed to be here. You're not supposed to know either. That well, was the politest you, fuck off, don't go in there that I've ever heard. Yeah, it was like, the, it was also, the, yeah, it was, actually, I consider it to be the politest, like, um. Uh, damn it, no. Why are you going back? Mm -hmm. Is that where I'm supposed to go? You need to go, keep going. Super I just want to find the next save point. Keep going. Keep an ear out. On the super sluts. Oh, oh, oh. Whiskey! <laughs> yes! Some kind of tracker. It's been modified. Oh my god! I love this thing. <laughs> okay. That is a motion tracker. No. No problem. <laughs> Wait, no, no, no. Back up, back up! Explore the room, please! For the love of Christ! Looks like there's a lot of goodies in here. There's <laughs> lots of stuff in here, including the computer you missed. And you're not being pressured to hurry up right now. <sighs> so take your damn time! Oh, an Door IBM override. computer. Let's look at that. Door override. Hughes, 
I put a manual lock on the door leading upstairs. Don't want any accidents until we figure out what's going on. Cheap. All right. Let's look at shared. Illegal seek. Okay. Look at shared. Our manifesto first published <laughs> in Eyes of Sixen. We don't want to show you a new world. We want to discover it with you. Here's at Sixen. Every new technology research project and discovery is driven to find real world of applications to help you. We hope you'll join us for the journey. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Uh, New world order. order. Join us, join us. Together, tomorrow, six is journey into colonial space, an official history by Sebastian C. I mean, First printed in I on Six. Our origins <laughs> in space. Twenty thirty four changed everything. The advert of the faster than light travel put Sixton then known as Sieg and Sun, on the path to success. The race into space began in earnest and under the steady hand of our founder, Joshua Sieg. Our company was primed and ready for years for that followed. Sieg and Sun built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond Sol system. As history relates, Wayland Corp was reluctant to share its FTL technologies with other corporations. Fortunately, Joshua Sieg was on hand to speculate in native, in, in innovative, and produce. Innovate. Thank you. Without Sieg and Son, the skies would muted. have looked very different indeed. No. Yeah, right. if you haven't figured it out, you have Wayland Yutani. It's basically making this entire space and planet conquering. Uh, a monopoly. All right. Is there assholes? Door access, very important. Override door mechanism. You just did it. Good job. I hear it. Hey, look, there's a rewire. On your right. Up the it's stairs. It's above you. Oh. It's above you. Upstairs. That's what I meant. <laughs> just start levitating. I will start levitating. Turn on no clip. There you go. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> Suffer I as I have suffered, you fool. <laughs> Suffer. It's not that makeup shop. Sephora. <laughs> 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 hmm. Thank you. Yeah. And that's all she wrote for today? Uh, that's all she wrote for today means someone is done. My cute voice is not helping. Your weird comment isn't helping either. That's so <laughs> fucking funny. <laughs> anyway, uh... Oh, you want to stop? Yeah, I think we can. I think I need to call it quits right there. How long have we been going? <laughs> I I would tell you, but OBS was being a bitch. Well, only forty-seven uh, about minutes. About an hour, it says. Yeah, forty-seven minutes, but also I had to reset the stream a few times. Oh come on, let's keep going. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were having uh, fun. You can finish the game tonight. No, I can't. <laughs> Speed run. No. Speed run. <laughs> okay, Kitty, go have fun signing your own fucking death warrant. I bet a speed I run. I mean, listen, really I got cool, life though. insurance in space. I'm good. Yeah, is life insurance gonna revive you from the fucking dead? <laughs> listen, I won't what, die. Why I only think it's called ghost. life insurance. <laughs> yeah, and how exactly. is life insurance? How is life insurance gonna help with xenomorph acid? Uh, it's You'd called a life insurance. Bro, just go covered. to the living room. He can't kill you there. <laughs> 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 you, 
The mistake you made, Golden, was you went to the cafeteria, because then he can eat you there. <laughs> or just press the emergency red button. Oh my god. Oh, this is fun.